Hey, it's Tuesday of Doom. All right, today I'm actually going to show you how to use the hat jack. Uh, I can't believe I didn't do this during the hat brushing video, but today I'm going to show you how to use the hat jack. The reason that I'm going to do this is, I can't believe I didn't do it before, but um, the reason is I've been sweating a little bit in this hat and either my head's got fatter or the sweatband has shrunk just a little bit, which sweatbands will do. Um, it's not abnormal. And one thing you can do is use a hat stretcher or hat jack to stretch it out. Now, the widest part will go on the bottom of the jack. Now it spins around. So you have to take notice of what you're doing. The widest part goes to the bottom of the hat. The uh, tapered end goes toward the top. And what you do is it uh, to tighten it up, you'll spin this one, it spins left and it tightens it up and it stretches out the hat. Now I'm gonna show you too. Now I did this overnight last night and it fit great. Um, this has a snap brim on it. Advantage Harrison has snap brim on it. Take a look at that and then I'll show you what it looks like when I put the hat jack on there. So take a look. There you go, okay. So I'm gonna set this in. I'm gonna pop the brim down. I'm gonna show you. That's what it normally looks like. The hat jack is not tight. And see, I've got, I'll show you in just a second. See, it's not tight. Now, as I tighten it up, I don't know how well you can see that. As I tighten it up, it really kind of warps the brim a little bit. Now, that's gonna happen. But if you have a snap brim hat, you just snap up the brim and it's not gonna do that. Your brim's gonna be fine. So that's what I did last night. I'm assuming that's for every hat. Now it worked for me last night. Um, I tightened it up, I snapped the brim up and it looked fine. My brim was not misshapen today uh, when I wore the hat. But what you do is you just take it and put the bottom pretty much flush with the edge of the sweatband. And that's gonna stretch out that metal reed in the hat. Because everything stretches, everything has an elasticity to it. And what that does, it stretches that, that metal reed in there, a little metal wire ever so slightly. I'm assuming it's metal in this hat. In the Federation Force, there's a wire. It's a little metal wire that they call a reed. All right. There we go. And then when you're through, you just take it. Let's show you. That's not really all that misshapen. We'll pop it up. And then all you do is you take it. I let it set out overnight. You can steam it if you want to. I didn't have to steam it. I just stretched it out, went to bed, take it out. And there you go. There's your advantage hat. Your Harrison. And what I'm wearing right now is my Tony Fawn um, Federation 4, which I also love. Uh, this one needs to be brushed. They both need to be brushed. Uh, and when you're setting a hat down, you set it down upside down. I know it looks cooler like that, but you want to set it down like that. Okay, moving on. I got a holster. It, uh, I got it from Amazon. Uh, it wasn't all that expensive. It's a nice holster. Um... All right, so to tell you about the holster, I had to look up where I got it on Amazon from Militaria Stuffs, and I'll post a, a picture on the video. Now, this is a nice holster. I consider it to be a nice holster. Never had an indie holster, so I don't know what to compare it to. But the leather feels good, feels firm, gets soft. 
feels like you can soften it up. Um, let's see here. Get that in there. I don't know how much detail you can see. It's shiny. If you're a Firefly fan. <laughs> um, but I don't have a gun that fits this. I have a Glock 43X. If I had a gun that fit this, I would keep this. Um, but I have a Glock 43X and I would like to find a holster, this design, that my Glock 43X could fit in. Now, if you or someone you know <laughs> makes one of these holsters that a Glock 43X can fit in, uh, and if you'd put me on the right track for that, that'd be fantastic. Uh, all that being said, I believe I'm going to do a giveaway and give this away. Now, to be eligible for the giveaway, you have to be a subscriber. Uh, comment on the video holster. And in three weeks, we'll do a um, we'll do a giveaway. I believe that'll give people enough time to watch the video, uh, subscribe, and, you know, build suspense. Uh, but yeah, hey, free holster, right? Okay, well, I hope you enjoyed the video on the hat jack on how to use it. Can't believe I didn't think to do this before. It's just because I don't think of things sometimes. And that's what I mean when I say um, at the end of all my videos, uh, comment, tell me what you like, tell me what you'd like to see more of. If somebody thought about that, um, you know, let me know because I don't mind doing it. I need material. Hope you enjoyed seeing the advantage again. Of course, you always see that. I'm always wearing it. This is a Federation 4 Tony Fawn. Um, I love all my hats. Uh, I'll do a video on the Akubra Capricorn summer hat. Um, okay. Well, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, thanks for coming back. We'll see you next week on Tuesday of Doom. And uh, have a great week. Enjoy it. And God bless.